This is a quick video about EEPROM Solar. You can find EEPROMs on uh, such things as this old graphics card from 1990. There's two EEPROMs there. And also old arcade game boards. And that's what gave me the idea. Uh, I've got a Xevious machine which had a ROM error. So uh, I thought to myself, oh, silicon, got a window on it. And I read up and people have done a couple of videos on these things but no one's shown them running. Well, at the moment, this one here from 1977, it's an Intel, is producing 0.272 volts just from the table lamp. If I get a flashlight, shine it on it, you can see that jumps to 0.410. A little bit higher in fact. But it needs a couple of them to do anything. So on here, I've got two more EEPROMs, and around the back, a little oscillator circuit. If I shine the flashlight on there, and we should see a little oscillator start up flashing. There we are. So, what I'll do now is I'll show this circuit running outside in the sun. And here we are now outside. We've got the EEPROMs facing the sun. And around the back, the LED is on all the time. Hey, it's not bad for what they are. We've got a bit of cloud at the moment and you can see how, hopefully how, the oscillator speed will change based on the amount of sunlight or amount of cloud. So just wait for the uh, sun to come out again and that oscillator rate should pick up. There we go. And there we are, speeds up quite nicely.